Look at him, dude. He's existing. He's got so many fins. What's the deal? Yo, what's going on, beautiful people? Riot here, and today we're fishing for some kaiju. This amazing... My controller's not plugged in. What the hell? There we go. Yo, what's going on, guys? Riot here. Today we're checking out Kaiju Fishing. This game I'm super excited for. This is like the updated demo. The demo just had an update where now they have like medium-sized fish, which is uh, which is very exciting to me, you see. I love Kaiju stuff. Got anything Kaiju-related, really. Plus, fishing is always so amazing. And this game is literally just Kaiju Fishing. It's like the best, the best premise ever. I could not be more excited for it. I'm like sailing over to the edge of the world right now so you guys can get a glimpse because like the only mega kaiju so far is on the other side of this. But it looks so badass and like the one in the trailer looks so cool. Let's get this video to like 47,000 likes, something around there because kaiju fishing just sounds amazing. We just need more of that on this channel. I can just, I can just barely see its fin over the thing. Plus if you guys want to uh, get involved in like the alpha testing and other stats or other stuff like that, I'll link their discord down below so everyone could uh, can get involved in it because like there's no it's not because i'm a youtuber just like anyone who wants to test it out gets access because it's an amazing community this kaiju is being elusive you can just barely see there it is there's the top of its spikes coming through oh my god dude i want to go mess with that thing so bad i can't wait for this to like update just like finalize i think it'll be done estimated by the end of uh 2021 which oh my god that's like a couple of months Woo! that's that's so cool maybe not like finished but like enough to be playable no more like test build versions I did post a video of this on my side channel at some point. There is a bunch of updates since then, but I'm going to cover the beginning stuff too right now because I've never actually tested if there's like other size fish and stuff, which sounds awesome. Okay, see that little alien cat on our boat? Alien cat thing? You know, it just kind of chills there right now, but once the game's finished, you'll get to like pet it and stuff, I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure how it'll come into play. Honestly, so much of this game is a mystery to me. It's just like some crazy world where there's kaiju, and that's like your job. You accept missions and sell the fish. It's freaking awesome, dude. I gotta shut up, though. If you if you get too excited, people just think you're throwing on an axe, but it's like, I'm just a huge kaiju nerd. <laughs> Honestly, if you're not obsessed with monsters even a little bit, I don't know where your life went wrong, mister. Like, what else is more epic other than giant monsters? It's the peak forever. Okay, so there's three kinds of fish in this little build before we go over to the other alpha builds. The tadfish, the flamander, flamander, and the puff puff. This is the tadfish right here. Little failure. I love weird looking alien type fish. It's such a great vibe. Like, I'll play a million games like that. The fact that I just get the fish for him, dude. And you just get him in this little green box, and then you catch him. Now, the tadfish has a bit of a, a, a disfigurement going on. It has one eyeball well bigger than the other, which is just... It's so weird to me, dude. It looks like it was, like, deep pressurized. Like, that side looks beautiful. And then this side just gets gross, dude. Eyeballs are... I don't know. My friend of mine had to eat one once while camping. A rabbit eyeball. Because when you're camping with those guys, you have to eat 100% of the animal. And ever since having it described how salty it is, I just can't look at eyeballs anymore. Yo, who else out there is getting their face destroyed by allergies right now? The earth is doing its best to purge me of its existence, and it, it's honestly just about working. Okay, I think there's more of them here. I think the Flalamanders only spawn in the cove over there. No, there's one right in my face! Wow, I'm stupid. <laughs> I really thought I, I legit was positive of it. See, it says I already caught a Puff Puff today, but I, I really feel like I haven't. But I'm gonna get another one anyways because they look so cool. I, I think these little guys, see the small fish, don't really, I think they just pull your line outs. They can't do much. And then once you get to the medium sized fish, that's where you start getting dragged around, which is just awesome. I think these guys, I, I, I once struggled with this little bastard, but now after testing out the other build for a second and failing terribly, whoa guys, a thick one. I guess you can still fail with the little fish. There we go. Our rod has its limits. Oh, that's a thick one. God damn, dude. That's crazy. 4.7. That's... Is that bigger? Are they all the same size or is that bigger? I just don't know. An amazing theme in this world is like their phalanges. No, that's... I don't know what that word means. <laughs> I bit off more than I could chew with that one. I'm just gonna go into the cove over here because I know they spawn like crazy over there. The flalamanders are my favorites. Because they, they just look... They look like the most incredible thing. Like, I would kill for one. Oh, I think this- no, 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 I don't want that loser fish. I'm sorry. You're not a loser, but I already have you. <laughs> I, don't, I don't want you anymore. Okay, there's no way I'm not getting one of these two, right? Right next to each other. Come on, little- yes! 
it, to you guys, it's been like five seconds, but it's actually been like ten minutes of me turning this boat around trying to acquire one of these things. This one looks tiny. It's so weird that it's supposed to be a five puff puffs. I don't understand. Let me just gather them by swimming by. Right, this guy, I'm just gonna lure him like crazy. There's, there's no reason to give him the dignity of a good fight. He's a lizard, and we're gonna treat him like one. Oof. This one's so pretty. I guess they're all pretty though. They've all been gorgeous. Frost things weighs nothing. As you can see though, a general theme of this world is like alien type stuff. This thing has six, six arms, four arms and two legs, or just four, six arms. I'm confused how that breaks down. That's so cool. It, it, it's broken me. I wonder how many I have in my fish tank now. Sometimes I send them and then just nothing happens. Wait, it's like down on the analog. There we go. Okay, it's just this guy in there. The fish tank aspect is really cool too. I definitely hope like in the final version, you're able to customize your fish tank more than like you really, I don't know. It's, I guess I'm not really 100% sure what the general theme is going to be because you only get to do this little mission in the demo. It's like, I'm assuming you're going to be selling what you catch. That, that just makes the most sense. So you'd be selling it at the shack for the most parts and then upgrading your stuff. Hopefully, there's so many ways this can be epic. I just am so excited. I'm very in the in the dark though with like information regarding it. I only know like various aspects, like what some of the creatures look like, what this guy looks like when he's not in the water. I'll throw that image up right now. Just stuff, just enough to get me insanely ins excited. See, this just beats it. Oh, there's my fish tank. Well done, Runa. You're a natural at catching the small fry. Feel free to keep fishing in this zone, but like I said before, stay away from the mossy rocks, because that's where the kaiju is. Okay, so now we're going to go on over to the alpha build, or beta. I'm kind of confused how that breaks down now. I guess it's the alpha, and this is the pre-alpha demo, or that's just a pre-alpha testing of a pre-alpha demo aspect, but either way, let's go on over to it. I've confused myself once again. Okay, so there's a few minor differences to see already. Plus, like, keep in mind, this is not a representation of the full game. It says it at the bottom. It's, like, clearly a test world. They're just updating little things more and more. I'm just a huge kaiju nerd who wants to, like, be a part of it as it updates the process. Because, like, look, look, little smoke comes out now when the sale comes out. I, I would have missed that otherwise. I wonder what's, like, happening to the main character. Because she's not here either. Clearly, she's undergoing updates. She's about to be, like, I wonder what's going to happen. I'm excited. Okay, so here's the medium-sized creatures. There's going to be, like, various kinds of medium the steam page shows like four or five of them or two or three of them i have no idea but like i never saw these ones before so as far as i could tell these ones are new i guess there's gonna be some kind of bait on the edge of the thing too that's why it's just a little green block i remember i was playing subnautica so early that when you spawned anything in the whole game was just green blocks really brings me back all right so we've got the fish now i did a couple dry runs with this so i wasn't a complete noob because otherwise it's like actually i would have been a complete noob for sure Okay, so this one pulls you around. You just kind of slow it down by tapping F a bunch or X. You get like this crazy kaiju cl catching claw that comes out, which I love so much. It reminds me of like Jurassic Park Lost World. I can't wait to see what happens when like the big kaiju come out because like if the medium ones pull you around, can you just imagine what's going to happen? Are you going to have to like fight for survival or like what? You have to get out of there? Something's going to happen. Okay, once he's like under it, you just press Y. Oh, son of a bitch. Okay, I'm screwing it up. I started out going easy on him so I could make like the video like I don't know so we could be more clear on what you do But now he might actually get away. Okay, hang on. I need to reel it in I'm reeling it in good, but see he's kind of stretching out the cord. This will slow him. This will slow him nicely Good good good. And now we grab him. Yes, and look at that. Look at this little guy, dude He's got appendages also He's got so many of I love everything here has so many fins. Oh, that's so sweet. Okay, so this one weighs 5.6. He's a clamp jaw. He's an uncommon rarity, so this one's gonna be like generally common, I guess. <laughs> that's what I don't know if we're able to view him in the fish tank though. And that's crazy. They just get like teleported in, which I'm actually all for. We're gonna need some sort of technological advancements if we're gonna be um if we're gonna be catching kaiju, if you even can catch kaiju. He doesn't go to our fish tank though. Completely ripped off. As far as I can tell, the Steam page hasn't mentioned anything as, like regarding getting a bigger boat and stuff like that. I don't know what's happening to me. <laughs> it's just, I'm flying backwards. I'm like trying to think, how's it going to go down if we run into a kaiju? What's the plan? What's the, what's the course of action? Do you just, I suppose, just pop those sails and just like kiss your ass goodbye? It's like, as you can see by the trailer, which I'm probably showing on screen right now, the, 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 the creature is going to be huge, like ungodly huge, like stand absolutely no chance. Whoa, what's happening? What the hell? I'm not even doing it. <laughs> this is God's work now. I don't necessarily think there's different sizes right now. Because although that sucker looks huge, dude. That is a chunking fish right there. That one looks beast. 
But I highly suspect it's not, because it's like testing. Why would they bother putting various sizes into a testing? That that's no point. The whole point right now is to make sure that the fishing thing works, and I think it's beautiful. Look, there's like a plunger stuck to this dude. That's how we're staying attached to this guy. I love it. We're not like, whoa, Jesus Christ! We're not like damaging the, the creature with like hooks and stuff, which I guess most people wouldn't be concerned about anyways, but I just love the playfulness. Like a suction, <laughs> a, a plunger. Plus, like, the animations and everything look damn good. Like, I think I think it's just about ready. If I was to give my advice as a tester, I think it looks super freaking pretty. I just can't wait to get out there and get me some fish. Imagine this thing is different sizes, or you see a giant one, and you're like, oh my god, it's the record breaker. Oh, he's in there! What? Okay, calm down, giant. <laughs> but this is a big moment for me, dude. I've been trying to get this little guy in there forever. Look at my fish. Look at that little monster I caught. Oh, that's incredible. I wonder if you're going to have, like, various ones. Little one, medium one, big one, or how that's going to break down. Look at him, dude. He's existing. He's got so many fins. What's the deal? All right, this is a pretty good place to end the video because I'm just going to stand here nerding out over various possibilities of monsters for the next 10 minutes, and that's going to get old. So yeah, leave a like on the video, subscribe, like check out their links down below in the description to get in contact with the game, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!